Mercedes young gun Andrea Kimi Antonelli may be on an extended break until the next round of F2 at next month's Emilia Romagna Grand Prix, but he'll be anything but bored. With the Silver Arrows kickstarting the Italian's preparation for F1 via maiden tests in the brand's 2021 car, the W12, at Austria's Red Bull Ring and Italy's iconic Imola circuit. And rumors are growing that Antonelli could replace Logan Sargent at Williams from this year's Italian Grand Prix, the first race after he turns 18. Antonelli already has enough points for an F1 super license, following title wins in Italian F4, German ADAC F4, and in Formula Regional, Middle East, and European. From where he jumped to F2 with a near vertical learning curve. In terms of driving, uh, braking, uh, because obviously I need to get used to the carbon brakes, uh, which were uh, quite, quite a big step. Um, compared to the previous cars. Uh, so that was uh, for sure one main thing and also uh, to be able to use a bit better the downforce of the car, uh, especially in the entry phase of the corner. Mercedes though has been behind Antonelli since 2018 and are helping the Italian to close the knowledge gap. Uh, I really enjoyed my, my journey so far with them and I'm really happy to, uh, to be with them also this year. Um, and I have to say they really helped me, um, not only as a driver but also as a person. And they're helping me especially in the past year, in the past few years they're helping me on outside the track as well. Um, they're helping me on developing my uh, physical uh, aspect. Antonelli is the coming man, despite the fact he's currently sitting ninth in the standings after three rounds and six races, with Australia's feature his best result so far with fourth place. The real question is, though, how quickly will Mercedes Jr. Antonelli get onto the Formula One grid? Will it be 2024 or 2025? Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.